What an absolute delight. Mira Sayal. Hello. You're back at the BAFTAs. I'm back at but the BAFTAs. not in any ordinary way. You are receiving the Fellow Award this evening. I know. It's really happening. Um, it is really happening. Someone's going to have to pinch me really hard. I'll do it very softly. No, I'm still here. So a little bit harder? I guess it must be happening. Um, when you first got the news, yeah. um, how did you celebrate? What was what was the process? It's like slight disbelief and then sort of checking the envelope, like was this meant for somebody else? But you know, once I got over the shock and had a chat with BAFTA, I just thought, well, you know, you go through so many years not knowing if anybody has seen what you do, and I feel like I'm taking it on behalf of a lot of other people. I really do. My ancestors, my fellow travellers, you know, it's symbolic. Um, so for that reason, you know, I was utterly honoured to accept it. Well, this is it. I think, you know, as a British public and as, as a fan, we've been on such a gorgeous journey with you, you know, from you were Smita Smitten. I'm not, I won't make you do it. I won't, don't. I won't know, because I know you get it all the time. But, <laughs> I wouldn't dare. It's not good for the makeup. Absolutely not. <laughs> but, you know, but from goodness gracious me to four shirts, your work on Anita and me, you know, to the split, like you've ha you really show us like what range is as a creative person. Um, do you now feel ready to accept these flowers? Yeah, you know, as, as women, we're really bad at that, I think. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, it's, you know, it's always, it's always awkward talking about yourself, isn't it? And, I think you just have to come to a place of acceptance where you go, you know, this is for a whole generation of people that battled against the odds and mm. made a living in a business that there was no role models, no precedence. So I honestly feel I'm part of a wave that I'm so proud to be part of. It's first generation South Asians. Oh, um, you know, there's so many of them with me. I know it. Well, that's it. I think you're seen as such a such a leader, not just in your own community, but just in television in general of what's possible for women, but of, of also, also what's possible for, you know, women of colour. Yeah, as well. yeah, I uh, hope so. Yeah. I'm just waiting for Shonda Rhimes to call and just, you know. I feel like I feel, I feel like that phone call. I need happen. to be in a bustle for God's sake. I a think bustle. You, you have been in every other outfit. So why, why not a bustle, Mira? So. Um, why not? Um, what can we look forward to you from in the in the future? Um, well, um, I'm. Ooh. Oh, oh, look at that. Bindi down. But oh all good. My bindi jumped off in protest. Do you know what it is? Your bindi's so excited to Hello. be to be on your forehead. What is from the red carpet that badly? Um, <laughs> Note to self, do not head, not head too much. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I'm appearing in a series called Wheel of Time, um, which is on Amazon and um, starts in the autumn. It'll be broadcast in the autumn. And then I have another series coming out called Mrs. Sidhu Investigates about um, a nosy middle-aged cook who falls into private detecting. So food and crime, my two favourite things. A perfect concoction. <laughs> Mira, thank you so much. Thank and uh, enjoy you. every single flower you get this evening because you fully deserve it. That is so cool. Thank you. Thank you so much.